If your company has ever been the victim of check fraud, you may want to use or your bank may require you to use positive pay. With this feature, you upload a file to your bank that contains a list of your issued checks. Then, as checks are presented to your bank for payment, the information on the checks is verified against the information in the file. If a discrepancy is found, the bank will notify you for manual authorization. Sage Mass 90 and Mass 200 have a positive pay file export feature, and in this tutorial, we'll walk you through the process of generating this file for upload. A prerequisite to using this feature is to obtain your bank's positive pay specifications and set up your export settings accordingly. For this demonstration, we've already completed this step. So now let's jump right in and get started. We'll begin by going to the menu tree and select Bank Reconciliation, Main, Positive Pay Export. The Positive Pay Export window contains all of the export settings that you've created for your banks and accounts. For our example, we'll highlight the Wells Fargo export setting and click Proceed, which opens the Positive Pay Export Processing window. The options here default from your export settings definition and can be changed here if necessary. If you need to change the defaults permanently, you'll have to return to the previous window and edit the export setting. The option to include checks already exported will typically be unchecked unless there was a problem in a previous export that would require it to be resubmitted. Moving to the selection criteria grid, we can select checks based on bank code where we can select a single or a range of bank codes that are designed to be used with our chosen format. For example, if you have multiple accounts with Wells Fargo, you could select a range here. However, this assumes that the bank codes are in sequential order and that your bank allows positive pay information for multiple accounts in one file. You can also set the default in the Positive Pay Export Settings window. Continuing on, we'll select the operand equal to, and then using the lookup, choose Bank Code D, Wells Fargo Checking. In order to include all checks not previously submitted, we're going to leave the operand for check number, check date, and dollar amount set to all. But you may use other operands as needed to refine your check selection. Now let's preview the Bank Reconciliation Positive Pay Export Log. Here you should review and verify the checks that will be included in your Positive Pay Export file. As you can see, the log shows our bank code with its description and the check information. Also, for each bank code, it includes the total number of checks selected and the total amount as well as the report total. Let's now close the report and click Yes to proceed with the Positive Pay Export. The generated file can be found in the folder that was specified in the export settings and it's now ready to be uploaded to the bank. Each bank has its own upload procedures, therefore, it's not practical to demonstrate the upload process in this tutorial. For specific instructions, you should contact your bank. To see which checks have been exported, you can view the Check Deposit and Adjustment Entry window. Let's take a look by going to the Menu Tree and under Bank Reconciliation, Main, select Check Deposit and Adjustment Entry. Using the lookup, we'll select the Wells Fargo Checking Account. Here on the Checks tab, we have a column that shows the checks that have been exported. If you need to re-export any checks, simply uncheck them and rerun the Positive Pay Export for those checks only. If you need to re-export all checks, you would select the option to export previously sent checks in the Positive Pay Export parameters, and then you could use your selection criteria to narrow down by check numbers or date. And that completes our demonstration. Give us a call if you need assistance with this or any other feature in your Sage Mass 90 or Mass 200 system. Well, that's it for this tutorial. Bye for now.